welcome. Today guys I'm going to be making for you a herb roasted Cornish hen. And for this you'll need a Cornish hen and if you can't find this you can use a small chicken. I have some paprika and the paprika is just to give it some color. Unsalted butter, orange zest, some dried basil, dried thyme, dried tarragon, fresh rosemary, minced garlic, some olive oil, some parsley, salt and pepper to taste and a few wedges of orange. So first we want to start by making the herb mixture for this. So I'm going to set the chicken aside. To a bowl, add in the butter, the tarragon, the basil, rosemary. And guys, if you didn't have the herbs that I'm using, just use herbs that you can find or you can get access to. The fresh parsley, the orange zest, or you can use lemon zest, fresh garlic, thyme, and I'm using dried thyme, but if you can find fresh thyme, you can use that, the paprika, and the olive oil. Mix to combine. Okay, once mixed, just set this aside and bring over the chicken. To the chicken, you're going to season it with salt and black pepper to taste. And guys, when you're putting salt, put, put how much salt you would like. Next, you're going to take your herb mixture and you're going to put some inside the cavity of the chicken. Make sure and massage that in well. And rub some on the outside of the chicken. Just lift the skin where the breast is and tuck some of this herb mixture under there. If you can get it all down by the legs, that would be great. Okay, next take your orange wedges and place it inside the cavity. All may not be able to fit. I have an entire orange here. If it doesn't fit, that's okay. You can always put it in the pan when you go to roast the chicken. In this pan, I have carrots and celery. I'm just using that as a bed and I'm actually using baby carrots. So you can use whatever vegetable you want. I'm going to place the chicken on this bed. I'm just going to place the leftover oranges in here. And now this goes into your oven to bake at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 30 to 45 minutes. If you have a small hen, it's going to take a shorter amount of time. If you have a bigger hen, it's going to take longer. Okay, the Cornish hen just came out of the oven. What I'm going to do is transfer this to a serving plate. go in and cut so you all can see how moist and juicy this bird is can you all see that can you all see it's so moist I'm gonna give this a taste Oh my goodness, this tastes so delicious with that orange flavor. And the carrots are very sweet and tender. I can't wait for you guys to try this recipe. So here you have it, my recipe for herb roasted Cornish hen. I hope you guys enjoyed today's recipe. If you liked this recipe, remember to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. If you're new to my channel and you like what you see, I hope you remember to subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all another day with another one of my recipes. Enjoy!